Big news. The Land Cruiser is now a hybrid. Every new 2024 Land Cruiser will come equipped with a hybrid powertrain, dubbed iForce Max. Like in the new 2024 Tacoma, it's centered around a 2.4-liter turbocharged i4 engine with an electric motor integrated into the 8-speed automatic transmission. This allows for hybrid power to reach the wheels through standard 4WD. Total output from the iForce Max powertrain measures 326 and 465 pound-feet of torque. Fuel economy is yet to be confirmed, but hopefully it will improve on the outgoing Land Cruiser's Thirsty V8, which got 13 seventeenths on city slash highway. Toyota set out to make the new Land Cruiser a proper off-road SUV, not just look like one. Running ground clearance measures 8.3 inches, with an approach angle of 31 degrees, 30 degrees on 1958 trim, departure angle of 22 degrees, and brake hover angle of 25 degrees. Every Land Cruiser configuration comes with a locking rear differential, hill descent control, off-road cruise control, and full-time 4WD with a two-speed transfer case. Higher-end versions gain terrain-specific driving modes, as well as a front-facing camera to better spot trail obstacles. Depending on specification, Toyota will include or offer other off-road hardware, such as color-adjustable LED fog lights from Rigid Industries, underbody skid plates, rock rails, equipment racks, and more, you'll be able to configure your Land Cruiser for any overland adventure. The new Land Cruiser will be offered in three trim levels. The entry-level Land Cruiser is called 1958, a nod to the year in which the vehicle was first sold in the United States. Equipped with round headlights and essentials for trail driving, the Land Cruiser 1958 has manually adjustable cloth seats, an 8.0-inch infotainment touchscreen, six-speaker audio system, and a built-in AC power inverter. However, the steering wheel and front seats are heated, adding some comfort. A locking rear differential and off-road cruise control are standard.